Okay, um, this is about, um, you just get an input, in, um, use a voice input, press A, uh, key stroke, um, as opposed to, to doing, you know, the, what most people will usually do is like, you know, find the voice input thing to, uh, all the, uh, applications, as you scroll through the menu, and, uh, go to different pages of applications, you'll find the voice, uh, voice input, but on the keyboard, um, on external keyboard or helper, all you have to do, and you're already familiar with this, is I'm going to go to advanced settings, and then I'm going to go to other settings, and it's under voice key input, see it says you can choose one key, which is crazy, but it works, or key combination that can be used to trigger voice input, so I want to show you the difference between using a key combination and just one key. So I'm gonna have it so that I can I can use two keys rather than one key. I'll have um, Alt and then I'll label this V. The scan code for V is 47. input um, I won't have a, um, a two step um, process it'll be just one key and I'll make it I'll still remain with the V I'll take off the alt and save that so now every time I just hit V the voice input comes on watch this really fast um, I wouldn't suggest doing too many one key operations or one key uh, uh, trigger our assignments because um, word of God forbid you had to use that letter to complete a sentence and every time you try to complete the sentence with that word you get you know an app launching or like the voice input launching it's important that it's probably better that you have at least um, an altered shift behind uh, the uh, key that you're assigning to to do that um, uh, um, operation I guess so voice input I'm going to go back and stuff, I'll just leave it the way it is if you got external keyboard helper pro. This came stock with these things already highlighted. Um, signature work was looking pretty good. Anyways, that is that. And um, I'll see if I can make another video. But once I figure out how to do the set device ID filter, which I'm not quite sure about. It's best to leave it alone if you don't know anything about it um, through the advanced settings. But anyways, that's how you do uh, voice input.